you want to close at a level that nobody could ever imagine was possible, you've got to find different language. Yeah, when you slouch around and drag your feet in all poopy pants, you're not going to sell no one. You're not going to close them. Words are godlike, and when you use these words, people should see in their imagination what it is that you're talking about and understand this vision all by your words and your language. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy. Today, I'm gonna talk to you about the eight deadly skills that top salespeople use. Now, I want you to understand this. When I was 18 years old, I got in sales. You know, everybody had something that they wanted to teach. This video is gonna be about the eight best skills that I believe that'll take you over the edge. Now, there are hundreds of micro skills. So, if I don't say one and you're like, dang Andy, no, that's the best one. Listen, I'm gonna tell you this right now. If you learn these eight, there may be 9, 10, 11, 12, I didn't name this video, the top 100 micro skills you need to know. We'd be here for four hours. And I know that you guys wanna train, you wanna get in here, you wanna find a hole that may be something that you're not maximizing in, and then you wanna get back to work and you wanna make more money, okay? So that's why I make these quick videos so that you can learn these. So this is gonna be the eight deadly skills that if you learn these, you can close anybody, anytime, any place. Let's get started. All right, number one is gonna be your eyes. Write this down. The eyes are the window to the soul. People can tell your intentions. Write that down, your intentions. What are your intentions? What do you want? Do you care about me more than I care about myself? Remember, whoever cares the most about the client wins victoriously in every cell. People can tell what your intentions are and where you're at and how much you care about them by your eyes. People can tell if you love what you do. People can tell if you think that they're important by what you give your eye contact to. So two things with the eyes. Number one, people are looking into your eyes and they're seeing what's inside of you. It's like the eyes are the window to the soul. I can see in your soul. You must surround yourself with good people. You must create good internally and people can see that in your eyes. Secondly, your eyes also, what you see out. Look, dude, I see people all the time. I'm having a conversation with you and like you're looking over here or you're distracted and looking over there and you're not even looking at me. Remember, people want to feel important. People want to feel significant. And how do you do that? By showing them that they're important, by looking at them with your eyes. I was telling my son this. I said, you know, the art of communication is almost dead in the world and it's sad. And the art of communication, like a handshake, like looking at people in the eyes when you're talking to them, those simple things go the furthest with human contact, with human interaction. And so step one, number one, the first pillar, the first secret, the most dangerous skill is going to be your eyes. Make sure that when you're having a conversation with them, make sure you stay focused on them. Look into their eyes. Look at them like they're important, because they are. Look at them like you're genuinely interested, because you should be. And change your life, you know, transform. When somebody changes, their eyes change. I wanna give you an example really quick, and we're gonna finish on the eye skill. But my wife, when I come home, sometimes I've had a long day, I've got a lot going on, I walk through the door, and my wife will look at me and she'll say, stop, turn around, go back out. She'll say, Andy, I see your eyes. I can, I can tell you're still at work and you're at home. She's like, I need the love eyes. You're home now, turn around, go back out, come back through. Leave work at work, bring your love eyes home. You're home with your family now, come on, turn around. And I know what she means. She can tell that my mind is somewhere else. It's a special skill to really be present where you are when you're with someone. When you're in a cell, when you're having a conversation with somebody, be there with them. Does that make sense? And people can tell if you are. They can see it in your eyes. So skill number one, the deadliest skill, one, is your eyes. All right, guys, number two, your teeth. All right, so when I talk to someone, my teeth showing while I talk shows them that I have a good state, I have a good attitude, I have good vibes, I'm in a good mood. Can I ask you a question? Have you ever been trained on state, S-T-A-T-E, which means not the state you live in, the state that you're in? I can't get you to buy something if you're not in a buying state. So what kind of state must I be in? I must be in a good state. And how can you tell if I'm in a good state? Because I'm smiling. Dude, if people are in a good mood, are they smiling? Yeah, people are in a good mood. They have good vibes. They're excited. They love life. They're living. It's infectious. So when I talk to people, I always make sure that I smile with my teeth. I make sure that I show them my teeth. This right here 
this shows everybody really what's on the inside and how you feel about life and honestly like what you're about. And so you gotta make sure, step one was your eyes, two, the closest thing to your eyes is your teeth. Show them, smile. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this and this will piss a couple people off, but you know, invest some money in your teeth. Invest some money in your smile. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, like some people don't brush their teeth and they're not gonna sell a lot. You gotta have nice teeth. And if you're watching this and you're like, man, I'm self-conscious about my teeth. Listen, go get braces. You know, get some veneers, you know. Invest, you know, $10,000 in your teeth. I, I know it sounds crazy, right? You'll thank me later. Listen, confidence comes, okay, from internally out through your smile. It shows people how you feel about yourself, how you feel about other people. But I just wanna tell you, like first and foremost, like a, a dangerous micro skill is the ability to smile and show your teeth while you're talking to someone. It shows people that you're in a good mood. That's the transfer of emotion over to them. Now they become in a good mood. You're in a buying state, they're in a buying state. You have good vibes, they have good vibes. It's the mirror effect. Who you are pushes back out to them. That's the rule. And if some of you, and I'm just gonna say this because I, I know everybody, okay? And you're self-conscious about your smile. You're like, I don't like my smile. I don't like this, I don't like that. Hey, listen, I'll tell you this. It, it, if you have jacked up teeth, just being honest, if you don't have a good smile, it is better for you to smile with a jacked up smile or jacked up teeth than it is not to smile at all. If that's you, invest some money into your teeth. Invest some money into yourself. Just, just do it. Like I see people go their whole life and they're self-conscious about it. Okay, so I love you guys. Skill number two is smile. You gotta smile with your teeth. Your mouth shows me the way you feel inside. All right guys, skill number three is gonna be the head nod. Now this is a good one. I need you to understand this, okay? It kind of goes like this. Does that make sense? You see what I'm saying? Notice my head. If I watch, two things here. I say, does that make sense? That makes sense, right? Watch this. Does that make sense? I mean, that makes sense, right? You see that? The head nod. Top salespeople always use a head nod. Always do the head. You don't want to do that, do you? No. You don't want to do that. Notice my head nod. However I move my head, you'll follow. And people say, oh, I don't do that. Bull crap. I can get you to do whatever I want you to do. My body language, you'll mirror image it. I swear it works on me. It's going to work on you. The top sales pros use it all the time. Okay? So when I say something, if I want you to say yes, I'm gonna be like, you've been in a situation like that before, right? Now watch, I'm gonna go to my hands. That's a skill that we're gonna get to. But the head nod and the hand, they tie together, okay? Hey, you don't wanna do that, do you? No, I wouldn't do that. Hey, you've seen people like that, right? <laughs> Have you seen them? Yeah, you've seen them. And dude, they're gonna do the same thing with you, okay? So it's a transfer of emotion, eyes, mouth, teeth, okay? Head nod, super important. And you, and you tie these things in with your selling ability and it moves people in the direction you want, okay? Do you got me? So number three, head nod, baby. Works every time. Super important, guys, if you're watching this video right now and you're like, Andy, I'm not built like that. Bullshit. Yes, you are. Okay, you gotta train. That's the way it works. Train or complain, it's your choice. Okay, every day I train the greatest in the world. You know what I mean? Are you ready to kick some ass and build your legacy and make history if you are? In the description box below on this YouTube video, there's gonna be a little link. You click on it, enter your phone number, email, full name, and I will personally reach out to you in the next 24 hours. If you're serious about kicking some ass, going to the new level, recreating, next version of yourself, I'm your guy. Let's kill it. Number four, skill number four, you already knew was gonna be the magic of the hands. These things are not made to go in your pockets. Amateurs keep their hands in their pockets. Pros have them out like weapons. It's like, it's like these fingers are weapons. They're, they're magic. I can paint pictures, tell stories. You know what I'm saying? Right? Like, have you ever seen that before like that? It's like these things are magical. Okay. Now tied in, watch this with the eyes. Watch, you know what I'm saying, right? Look, I'm looking at you in my eyes, my teeth. Yeah, you know what I mean, right? And then my head nod. Yeah, you know what I mean, right? Eyes, mouth, head nod, hand. See them all flowing together? Dude, this is like an artist. This is my canvas. And as I'm talking to you, I'm gonna move like this. I'm gonna talk like this. I'm gonna paint pictures. I'm gonna show you what it is that I see that I want you to see. Whatever I feel, I want you to feel. And I'm gonna push it into you. These hands, they do not belong in your pockets. Keep them out. Don't cross your arms. Don't put them behind your back. Keep them right here in front of you, okay? Trust me, 
These will bring energy to your words and they'll bring energy to your customer, okay? If you want your customer in a buying state, you're gonna need all these things. But number four, skill number four, is gonna be the dangerous micro skill of the hands. All right, guys, number five. This is gonna be one that's gonna take some of you by surprise and it is your feet. Sandy, what does that mean, my feet? Well, they're not gonna notice your feet, but they'll notice the way you move, the way you talk, the way you work, the way that your energy moves, the way that you move around, okay? I position myself differently as I'm talking to someone because it brings excitement, it brings value, it brings entertainment, okay? And people don't catch what all is going on, but it's going on because I'm moving my feet and I'm moving around as I'm talking to someone. Does that make sense? Just like my hands. A lot of times people don't even know that I'm moving my hands, but when I'm moving my hands, I'm creating energy, I'm selling things, I'm painting pictures, telling stories, selling ideas, selling situations. They're moving here. They're also moving down here. Okay? It's not like I'm dancing, but I'm moving. It's, it's like, you know, you remember when you were young, it was like Rico Suave, right? It's called swagger, okay? People don't notice that you're moving your feet, but they are moving and they are shifting because you're moving the client. You are the leader and you're leading them, okay? So, your feet. Most people would never teach or, or never train you on this. You are a storyteller, okay? You are a magical storyteller and your feet will move when you're telling the story, when you're selling. So number four, the greatest closers, the greatest salespeople, right? We're gonna use their feet. So the greatest closers, the greatest salespeople know that skill number five, okay? Skill number five, tied in with their hands, tied in with their eyes, tied in with their mouth, tied in with their head nods, is going to be their feet. All right, number six. Notice, posture. What? Andy, posture? Yeah, when you slouch around and drag your feet in all poopy pants, you're not gonna sell no one, you're not gonna close them. Closers know the authority is in the posture, okay? I got my eyes, I got my mouth, I got my head nod, I got my hands, I got my feet, and I got my posture. What does posture have? Confidence, belief, self-esteem, authority, the leader, posture. Dude, if you're the person that has the information and you're the one that's serving them this value, should you come from an authority figure with posture, with love, that you know what you're doing? Yes, the expert posture, okay? So number six, okay, micro skill number six is good posture. A lot of people don't, do like this. Okay, you gotta be like this, okay? Good posture, show people. Represent yourself well, it's your brand. Okay, if you believe, show them that you believe through your posture. All right guys, number seven, magical, magical number seven is gonna be tonality. You already knew I was gonna say it. High then low. Take them on a roller coaster ride with your voice. Okay, tonality. It's something that you say to pull people in. It's something that you say to get people excited. It's something that you say to make people understand about the passion that you feel about this product, about them, or about this thing that we're gonna do. Tonality, pauses. Watch. Dude, you know what I'm saying? Just, just imagine. What would it feel like if that thing was happening in your life? Right? I mean, could you imagine what it would feel like? It's tonality. Did you notice the tonality and the pauses in between? The words were the words, but the tonality that I was using, high, then low, then high, then low, the engagement pulling you in. And by the way, like, look, dude, I love that people are like, oh, that shit doesn't work on me. Bullshit, I'll close your ass any day. You're a fool. Guys, listen to me, okay? These micro skills are dangerous, they work. They work in any situation. They can work with your family. They can work with your kids. They can work with getting a raise. They can work with getting a job. They can work with asking a girl out. They can work with doing anything, getting your point across to anybody that you want and getting them to understand and, and back your vision, okay? Super important. So guys, skill number seven, and for all my closers out there, for all my future top salespeople, for all my leaders, if you want people to buy in like never before, skill number seven, tonality. So important. All right, number eight, last, and I saved the best for last. This is gonna be the great separator. The first seven are gonna build you to be a killer. 
and number eight is gonna separate you from everyone else on planet Earth. Are you ready? Guess what it is. Just think, what is Andy gonna say? It's your language, it's your words, okay? If you wanna be different than everyone else, you have to have different language than everyone else. If you wanna fit in with the other 99%, that's fine. If you wanna be the top 1%, learn how to deliver information with different language, different words. If you wanna make relationships others can, if you wanna stand out, if you wanna be different, if you wanna close at a level that nobody could ever imagine was possible, you've got to find different language. Words are godlike, and when you use these words, people should see in their imagination what it is that you're talking about and understand this vision all by your words and your language. Guys, these micro skills, these things that I just talked to you about. By the way, I know hundreds of them. I gave you some on this, this training video today, and I want you to watch this 10 or 15 times. I want you to master them. It's the rule of 10. Figure out something difficult to do. What do most people think is difficult? Sales. Find something difficult. I'm teaching you it's quite easy, but they think it's difficult, but you're gonna learn this and then you're going to get 10 times better than anyone in the world and the rule of 10 works and you will become a multi, multi, millionaire. I'm creating multi-millionaires all around the world. And by the way, if you're watching this video right now and you're like, Andy, dude, I want to go to another level in sales. Like I want to go to another level in leadership. I want to go to another level in business. That's what I want. I want to be a great communicator, man. I just, dude, I just want to become greater. Period. If that's you and you're watching this, I would love to take you on a journey and coach you. Okay. So what do you do? Number one, there's a link below. Okay, if this is the day where you're like, dude, I'm ready to train and go to another level. I'm not playing around, I'm ready to make a decision. There's a link below in the description box, it's down below. When you click on the link, you're gonna about answer about eight questions, and then I want you to fill out your name, your phone number, and your email. I will personally reach out to you, and we will make a plan. I always say there's a day you're born, the day you die, and the day your life changes forever. If you're ready to change your income, you're ready to change what you're earning, you're ready to change who you are, the world's a mirror, and who you become will determine what you get. And if you're ready to change, I wanna do it with you. Guys, go down below, click on that link in the description box, answer those questions, make sure your information is correct so I can reach out to you. I love you, I got your back for life, I'd love to help you grow. I'll see you in the next video.